Hi, my name is Randy Kapralik. I'm head of the trombone department at University of the Arts in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Um, I'm here to introduce the solo adjustable cut mute for trombone. Uh, this mute is really well constructed, it's lightweight, it blends really well in the section and also has a very unique sound in a solo setting. <laughs> I played this recently on a few big band gigs and it blends really well with uh, the traditional cut mute. If I put this right in the middle. Now here's the same thing with it in its closest position. I notice even when I give it a little bit more air than I generally do in a traditional cut mute, it seems to hold the sound a little bit more with a little bit less of the raspy sound normally associated with cut mutes. As an educator, I adjudicate a lot of high school jazz festivals, and what I find is whenever trombone sections are using cut mute, I find that I'm always saying to them, blow through the mute, because I always feel like that with the extra resistance that the mute adds, they kind of reserve their air a little bit more, but with the solo cut mute, um, it resonates a little bit more, and it's, easy, it's a little freer with the air. For quick mute changes, uh, it's really easy to pull out either from, right from the bottom or from the cup itself. Another thing I really like about this mute is it actually doubles as a straight mute. So if you're a college student on a budget, you're playing your jazz band, wind ensemble, uh, musical pits, um, you can use this as a straight mute. I would definitely recommend this mute for my students, especially as a cut mute, considering that if I put it right in the middle, I feel like it can blend perfectly with all of the other traditional cut mutes that people bring to gigs. Um, but the, the benefit of this is there's less resistance, and I feel like I have to work less hard to get the same sound as everybody does, uh, which is really the name of the game. Um, you never want to be working harder than you need. 